It goes without saying that some animals are dangerous. But the creatures on this countdown are the dark horses of danger. Researchers observed the 28% kill rate in which these poor birds found themselves in the belly of the beast. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 surprisingly dangerous animals. Uh, in higher doses, it can lead to paralysis, cardiac arrest, and death. For this list, we've looked at those animals that might not immediately be considered dangerous, but definitely are. <laughs> Number 10, the bottlenose dolphin. Hey, you're not sharks, you're dolphins, the clowns of the sea. Ow, ow. We know, we know. Why pay lots of money to swim with these things if they're also surprisingly dangerous? In truth, the bottlenose dolphin is rarely harmful to humans, but should it choose to attack, then the very last place you wanna be is in the water with it. It's a fish. It's a mammal. Along with the also unexpectedly aggressive short-finned pilot whale, bottlenoses boast awesome power that best not be underestimated. Creatures famed for their intelligence, they can and will outsmart almost anything in the ocean. Oh no, you poor thing. Here. Ow! Number 9. The Cone Snail. You might think that snails are a sure bet in terms of safety, but you'd be way wrong. It looks harmless, but appearances can be deceiving. The cone snail is one of nature's most unexpected ruthless predators, and a real advocate for the old saying that looks can be deceiving. The fish is paralyzed within seconds, reeled back in, and swallowed. Sporting shells that are curiously colored and commonly conical, it is definitely best to admire these things from a distance. It's armed with at least a hundred different toxins, more than any other creature. When hunting, cone snails release a complex toxin that paralyzes their prey before swallowing it with remarkable speed. There is no known antivenom, and human deaths have been attributed to cone snail stings before, so beware. Once its prey is helpless, the cone snail retracts it through its proboscis until it engulfs the fish, swallowing it whole. Number 8. Deer A hunter goes looking for trouble and finds it. Next, to an animal often overlooked when ranking danger scales, but one that really shouldn't be. <laughs> Deer are a fairly common sight for anyone living in or around wooded areas. But as beautiful as their appearance is, these animals are not to be approached, as there have been several deer-human confrontations. They're strong, fast, and very territorial. You know, and that's before I knew really how strong, how fast they were. The vast majority of deer are herbivorous, and so are not an immediate threat to man. However, should they feel threatened, then these guys will fight fierce. And with their enormous antlers, you'd better believe it'll hurt. But the stunt has left Lynn bruised and bloody. These are the pants that I was wearing that day. And you can see they tore them up pretty good. As for the deer, the chestnuts never saw them again. Number seven, the hooded pitoey. You ever get something really awful in your mouth and you feel like just going, Native to New Guinea, the hooded pitahui holds an incredibly rare animalistic status. It's a bird and it's poisonous. After handling the pitahuis, our mouths begin to tingle and burn and even go numb. An extremely uncommon combination. It's entirely unusual for a bird to be considered dangerous for toxin and or venom related reasons. But when handling the pitahui, which WatchMojo would like to make clear is not a very good idea, one can expect at best a tingling sensation at worst, complete numbness and possible paralysis. Gram for gram, it's one of the most toxic natural substances known. The neurotoxin on their skin and feathers can be fatal if the dosage is large enough. So as beautiful as they may be, best to let this bird fly away. And now that we've figured out where the pitahuis get their toxins from a small beetle in New Guinea, there's some potential that this might be developed in the future. Number six, the assassin caterpillar. This has to be the most lethal larva out there. The aptly named assassin caterpillar is responsible for an ever-increasing human fatality figure in South America, causing its victims severe internal bleeding, which can lead to mass hemorrhaging and brain death. 
It's all due to a simple yet incredibly severe defense mechanism which sees the caterpillar's many bristles and spines attached to anything unlucky enough to come into contact with it, administering a devastating venom. These things are small, silent, and definitely deadly. Number 5. The Raccoon After all the shit that we've been through tonight, I don't know how much more I can take. Though not especially known to attack humans without real reason, if a raccoon does turn on you, then it can be very bad news. Oh, These visually distinctive animals have become increasingly common within urban areas, with instances of a raccoon biting or lashing out increasing as well as a result. The kids say a hissing raccoon appeared out of nowhere and went straight for Irie first jumping right at her face. Not only can raccoons be particularly vicious when they attack, but they can also carry rabies. So basically, if you ever find yourself bitten by one of these, then get to the hospital ASAP. Oh, yeah. Number four, the beaver. Hey buddy, don't attack, don't attack. With the beaver population rapidly decreasing across the world, seeing one of these animals in their natural habitat has become a rare and potentially wonderful thing. However, as with everything else on today's countdown, beavers are best viewed from a safe distance. What the? Pick up, Jack. Oh, hey. Get too close, and chances are you're encroaching on their territory, which is something you do not want to do. Beavers spend a great deal of time and effort building their dams and marking surrounding areas, and they will defend against any intruder with sometimes extreme aggression. You do not want to be on the receiving end of a bite with those teeth. Number 3. The Parrot What's a dog? What? You know better than that. The pretty poster boy of tropical birds, the producer of all manner of calls and noises, the parrot's the exact opposite to the classic cliché. This thing's bite is way worse than its bark. Ah! Oh, geez! Geez, she's on me! As with most birds, there are two main focal points for danger, its beak and its talons. <laughs> But unlike most birds, the parrot is a common household pet. Domesticate them at your own risk, however, as they can prove unpredictable. He decided to get jealous of everyone else who ever came near me when he was around. He's attacked my mom, he's attacked my girlfriend, actually sent her to the hospital. Parrot owners have reported lost fingers, toes, eyes, and earlobes before. Apparently what Polly wants, Polly gets. Not cool, man. Not cool. <laughs> Number 2. The Platypus It has webbed feet like a frog, a bill like a duck, and venom like a snake. In their own ways, all of today's animals have been at least a little bit unusual. But none can claim to be as unusual as our runner-up. So to hunt, the platypus closes its eyes, its ears, and its nose, and lets its bill do the work. The platypus is so strange looking, the first Europeans to view it believed the animal to be some kind of elaborate Australian hoax. It's one part duck, one part beaver, one part otter, all parts odd. But what's often overlooked is that the platypus can also inflict some severe pain. They found that the venomous spur of an angry male caused pain and swelling that lasted for weeks. A venomous spur on the hind feet of the males is enough to make a grown man weep. Its hidden weapons, sharp spurs located above the heels of its hind legs. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. kind of math missiles use to hit their targets. If you look at its front feet, you can see it's got these two huge claws on each one of them. Number one, the panda. Animals don't come much more iconic than today's table topper. But the panda scores this top spot with a side to its character a little less talked about. Hey, hey. 
forever billed as the most docile, relaxed, really rather lazy species of bear, the panda is unexpectedly dangerous because we don't really think it's going to bother attacking anything at all, on account of the effort required. <laughs> However, due to their size and strength, when pandas do attack, it doesn't take much for things to get ugly. Ow, 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 it's my leg. Usually provoked out of irritation rather than actual aggression, it's best not to annoy these adorable animals. <laughs> do you agree with our list? Wow! Can I punch through walls? Which surprisingly dangerous animal did we overlook? This ain't your grandma's catfish. For more surprisingly scary top tens published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com.